what's good YouTube and welcome to what I'm hoping to be an official introduction to my vlogs and my vlogs are basically going to be about my drifting experiences and my Nissan 240SX build. It's a convertible um, for those of you who don't know. I'll be kind of just like updating and vlogging on my like drift events and the new things that I'm putting on my car or doing to my car. So yeah, this is kind of just going to be like a variation of clips that I've already filmed. I've tried vlogging so many times. So many times. And it... See, even Manji, like my dog, I don't know if you can... Yeah. Even Manji's kind of upset because I think I started vlogging like when I first got her, which was, she was eight weeks old. Now she is seven months old. So yeah, you get the picture. It's taken me a really long time to like fully commit mainly because like I get nervous on the camera, like I can't speak to the camera. Um, I don't know what to say. I get nervous and like just stuff like that or like I'm out of memory on my phone because I've been vlogging on my phone or I vlog on um, the GoPro so yeah sorry if there's like quality differences in the video but I mean it is what it is at this point so hopefully I'm hoping to take you guys on my adventures and show you guys how it is especially for like a female in a male dominated sport I guess you can say I mean the rise is definitely high for all those women I see you but yeah I mean I hope that this could be Manji Anyways, I'm hoping that this could be kind of like something that other females that are trying to like get into drifting or building a car, just something for them to kind of like relate to, relate to because um, I kind of wish I had that when I first started. Like I wish I had like other women to like look up to. I mean, I've seen a lot of them on like Instagram and stuff like that, but never like a vlog it's always like the dudes it's always the guys and I think it's time for a change I think women need to know that they can do it too um, a little bit of background on myself I have done auto painting I started auto painting in 2000 and like 9 or 10 when I was in high school and then I kind of fell in love with welding, so I switched that until I graduated high school, which was 2011. So, I mean, for those of you who think I got into stuff like that because of my my boyfriend or whatever, you're wrong. You know, like, I've, I've always been into cars, I've always been into this, I just never had, like, the push to do it, and, um, you know, the motivation or the money. So now I do, and now it's happening, and now I'm gonna continue with it, and I'm not gonna. Now I'm gonna make it happen. So I hope you guys stick around and, you know, watch my collection of videos and my little progress that I've made um, since August. So yeah, stick around. <laughs> YouTube and welcome back um, I have not at this point I have not been able to upload any of my uh, footage from my previous vlogs unfortunately but hopefully those will get updated soon I've been having issues um, 
anyways, I've been having issues um, being able to have enough storage on my my computer. Um, so it hasn't been letting me do it. So I'm trying to figure out how to obtain enough storage to be able to film everything. Oh my god, you're so bad, Manji. Oh my god, you distract me. Anyways, so I'm gonna be um, welding in my hydro e brake today if I make it in time. It's already about to be five. Yeah, eight minutes till five. So hopefully, I make it to my boyfriend's house in time. So shout out to him again for always coming through and spoiling me. Um, he, yeah, obviously he got me my hydro e-brake and I'm so thankful and I'm so grateful to have a man that really loves and supports me for what I wanna do. Um, so yeah, just keep watching and by the time It'll probably take me an hour to get there, but I'm sure. Oh my god, Manji! As I was saying, it's gonna take me about an hour to get there because of traffic. It usually doesn't take me this long, but it's gonna take me a minute. So I will catch up with you guys when I get there. So we're finally here. Say what's up. Mm. Say what's up! The sky is up. Anyways. He tacked in the kind of like a base plate, right? Basically, like reinforcement is. plate, the yeah. tunnel reinforcement plate for the hydro. They know that you didn't I, mention. I did mention because oh, I've on your already way here. started vlogging. Anyways, so that's already in. That's kind of like a little template of where I'm gonna be welding this bad boy. Yep. So yeah, I think we should get started because it's already late. And fucking dark. This is too long. Fuck. I should put my hair back a little bit. Today, woman. Ow! <laughs> Can you even catch that on camera? Are you even She's fired. Now? did stop recording um i want to say like halfway through um the weld maybe i recorded a little more i don't remember but um i mean there wasn't too much else to really record because we didn't actually get to weld the actual hydro to like the plate uh we also didn't get the line set up or anything like that so um I'll probably be doing that. Well, Daniel's going to actually be welding the hydro itself, like, onto the base plate um, that we just welded in tonight. So, he'll be doing that tomorrow while, like, I'm at work and stuff because I don't really have time to do it. And we want to kind of get it set up for um, this Wednesday so I can do, um, so I can practice with it because I've never, obviously, I haven't had a hydro in my car. I've only used it once, and it was in Daniel's car when uh, my radiator cracked. I ordered another one from Minjuku, and there was some like shipping issues. Uh, yeah, that will be the next thing that gets done. So we're here. We find we've been here for a while actually, but I just did donuts. We blood the clutch. Um, trying to get the hydro. I still haven't tried it out yet.
for watching. I definitely have more content coming up soon. Um, it's a new track season at my local track at Sonoma. So I'll definitely be updating on my progress there. I have new car parts coming in as well. So I'll be kind of showing you guys uh, what I've done already to my car. And then all the progress I'll continue to be making on it. Um, so yeah, stay tuned.